What is poppin' my party people? It is your boy Victor Dawson and we are back at it with another video. Yes ma'am, honey. Now, all my Marvel fans, as you can tell from the background, the shirt, honey, it is what if time. Yeah, y'all didn't think I was gonna be reacting to what if, but honey, I am. I know I didn't react to Loki and that was just a whole nother situation. I don't even want to get into that. But we are here to react to what if the animated series and basically what if is something Marvel Studios has made at to kind of play with the MCU timeline and as to say like what if this happened and what if this happened instead of this and in this first episode it's looking like from the title and the thumbnail it's going to be all about Sharon Carter and it's going to be like basically what if she not Sharon Carter Peggy Carter I'm sorry but it's going to be like more like what if she became Captain America and not Steve Rogers Captain America so we're going to see their little spin on this and then I also want to watch this because you really need to watch everything Marvel puts out because you never know what they will include into the main MCU timeline. So that's another reason why I want to watch it. So if you like anything, anything when it comes to reactions, then baby, this is the channel for you. So hit that bright red subscribe button, hit that like button, and also hit that bell so you know every time I P-O-S and T, sweetie, don't get it twisted. Now let's go on and roll this intro, shall we? Alright you guys, we are back and we are ready to get into the mist, grab your water, grab your snacks, and let's get into the gig, shall we? Okay, Marvel Studios presents these names, honey. We got Sebastian Stan, we got Stanley Tucci. It's more than a linear path. The way that they're about to switch this up, honey. <laughs> oh, the suspense, honey, is killing me. Come on, suspense. Okay, Steve Rogers going into the machine. So where does Miss Peggy Carter come in from? Is my lips ashy, honey? I feel like I'm giving ash. Come on. He did. Can we get into how crystal clear this looks? Oh, and it's animation. Period. You better stick by your man. And I'ma stick beside him. I'ma stick beside him. Oh, come on now. Margaret Peggy Carter chose to stay. But soon it would be her venturing into the unknown. Okay, so this happens before he transforms instead of after. Okay. Oh, oh. And just like that, Steve Rogers dead. Oh my goodness. Come on, you better give me pose. Oh, she's giving, bitch, I got you. She's giving, yes. Ciao. Girl, get up in there. What are you doing? She going to get that serum, honey. Agent Carter, what are you doing? This is our only chance. Now! Start. Don't do this. Come on, girl. You better give me She-Hulk. You better give me Strong. Come on. Mm -mm. Oh. Yes, Swole. Come on, Swole. Did it work? And then salute failure. Sixty million dollars and all the hope. Sixty million dollars. Oh my goodness. If I hadn't stepped in with Child, oh, honey, she is a super soldier, honey. You need to go sit your butt down. Just because she a woman, she could probably do it better than these men. Come on, girl, you got this. Oh, yes. Not according to Colonel Flynn, weapons great. Oh. I love this different like spin on this story because like you get to see like maybe this should have happened like this and how this could have been this way. Oh my god, I'm confusing myself, but hopefully y'all get what y'all got. Y'all get what I'm saying. Oh, there we go, confusing again. Do you see how the red looks like it's peering through his skin, honey? 
more like two-thirds of the way, but we have a chance. If we this doesn't concern you. You're lucky to be in the room. Colonel, the greatest minds on Child, you keep saying I'm lucky to be in the room, but honey, at the end of the day, I can take you now, so what's up? Oh, yes, with the, oh, come on, shield. Yo, she like that, she like that. Oh, my goodness. Come on now. Captain Carter, don't play with him now. Oh, that look good. Yes, mama, give me superhero stance. My girl ain't playing. Bump through. She actually looks real good in this world. They should have thought about, you know, doing like a little live action situation. <laughs> Come on now, Captain Carter. She like this new pot, this new found power, honey. Oh, come on. There we go. There we go. There we go. Beat they beat them up, honey. Beat them up. Show them who what's up. You're an agent. You're not qualified. But she just brought you the Tesseract, so you might want to be grateful. Mm -hmm. ooh, ooh. I owe you one. You owe me more than that. You owe me a dance. Oh. Come on now. And it's so cool to see like different little things that they switched up a little bit and how Captain America got to certain places with her storyline. Since when did dames fight like that? Child, it's a new breed, honey. That Oh. Literally, this is like watching a recap of Captain America, the first Avenger. Like, it's like a quick recap situation, but at the same time, we're showing you a new light. Where are you at? What? Now, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm saying. So, like a war machine type of vibe. Oh my goodness, I love this. I love this. I love everything about this. Dancing shoes. What do you think? Well, then we better stop. Literally, it's like we're already fast forward to Iron Man. Like, come on, y'all. A god. Honey, go sit down. You ain't no god. You lost the Tesseract, sir. Reich. Third Reich will fall. And Hydra will rise from its ashes. Hail Hydra! Oh. A hero. <laughs> <laughs> You're my hero too. Oh. Come on, love connection. Hey, oh. Oh my God! Not the ice. Not the snow scene. No, because this is the scene where Bucky dies. Well, he don't die, but. He dies. Oh, oh, oh. Thanks. You almost ripped my arm off. Rogers. No. <laughs> oh. Wait. This didn't happen in the movie. Hold on, hold on. Oh my god, Steve Rogers, Captain America, stop playing. No. No. No, he can't be gone. Girl, he can't be gone. So that's the way y'all do this? He'll tell you nothing. He told me everything. According to our German guest, Red Skull believes he can unleash an Stop. Mm -mm. Did he go with that test right, honey? Trying to um, make a weapon. Come on, Bucky. You better lead the team. Okay, so he see that Steve is alive, hopefully. Ooh. Come on, Nick Fury. What? Maybe we need a plan. <laughs> Stop. You okay? Yep. Good, because we don't have all day. Where's Peggy? No, go get your woman, Steve. 
So you gotta pay attention, girl. Them tentacles are tentacling. Oh. Oh, this is giving very much Guardians of the Galaxy. Um volume two opening scene. Girl, you need to make sure you not go with it, honey. Who he brought over there? Go get him, Steve. Oh, honey, you ain't got no more juice. You can't help. What is you gonna do? You owe me a dance lesson. Yes. I know she ain't about to get taken out by no octopus. I know she ain't about to be taken out by no octopus, honey. She could have went out far bigger than that. Oh my god, I remember this. Oh my god, it looks just the same. And Hawkeye was over there in the corner. Nick Fury was down there. Okay, girl, killed. I'm glad you back. I'm glad they didn't make it seem like you was gone. Look at Hawkeye. Oh, so they tell her at this moment? Because technically we're in Avengers right now. Oh, my goodness. And over just like that. Is there like an after credit scene? Because, you know, we can't... um. We can't never just click off, honey. There's always something. There's always something. Okay, I don't see anything. But I like I like this little show. I like this little animation episode that we got with the what if. It's going to take me a minute to adjust to see this whole new like timeline in animation form. But I like it. I like the different timelines they can say with doing this. I like how they can just play around with the characters. I did like how my girl is now, you know, Captain Carter, honey. I would have loved to see her in a scene with like another superhero or something, but look, we just getting what they're giving. I love how we saw Hawkeye and like the way that they switched up the telling of the story, like they told the same story of Captain America, but also switched it up in various key ways that you will only understand if you watch it. So if you haven't watched any of the Marvel Cinematic Universe movies, you need to watch those before you watch the What If because you can really grasp at how they flipped the script and told it in a different light. So I loved everything about this. Um, I'm not really big on animation, but I can get into this because clearly Marvel put their stamp on it. And honey, when Marvel put their stamp on it, it's that on that. And that's on period, honey. So let me know what all y'all liked about it. I cannot wait until we get to see Black Panther. Maybe that episode is coming up soon. But I did love this Captain um, Carter episode. Um, let me know again, like I said earlier, what you thought about it. If you like this video, please click that bright red subscribe button. Y'all follow me on all my social medias at Victor A. Dawson. And don't forget to press that like button, y'all. And I will see y'all in the next what if episode. Bye, guys.